Hello, welcome to this video. It's about a circle graph and we're going to use some ratios to, uh, I think, get a better understanding of what's going on here. Um, now, in this problem, we, we have this, this graph and it's about the number of students playing instruments and we see for every instrument here, there's a number associated with it. That has got to be the number of students playing that instrument. So eight are playing cello, nine trumpet, 11 drums, 15 violin, and 17 flute. And um, so this is the school orchestra. And we want to know what percent of the total number of students in the school orchestra play the violin. And if we look at a circle graph in, in general, let me just sketch this out here. When you have a circle graph, if you can cut it in half, right, this half piece, that would be 50%. And you can see right away that the, the piece for the violin is definitely less than this right here, or half the circle. So there's no way it could be 75%, right? What would 75% look like? Well, if you had another circle graph, um, it would be about 3 fourths. Oops, that's awful. Let me fix that. So half, right, is this section right here, cut in four pieces. Each of those pieces is a fourth. So 75% would be three-fourths. That's what 75% is. Um, so it would look something like this shaded region right here. That altogether, that's about 75%. And this, just to get a sense of what's happening in a circle graph, half of the circle is about 50%. So here, there's no way that it's 75%. And in fact, um, just by eyeballing it, I'm going to say the closest is either 25 or 33. 15% is, 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 I think, a little bit too small. But let's let's figure this out. So what's going on here is that the total, the percent, um, and in general, a percent is just going to equal um, what you have out of the total, out of a hundred. So here, the total amount is going to be our denominator, which is just fifteen plus eleven. Right? I'm just going to add up the amount of people in each group, plus nine plus eight plus seventeen. And out of that total, 15 play violin. Well, what is 15 plus 11 plus 9 and so forth? Well, 15 and, well, 11 and 9 is 20. 8 and 17 is 25. And then we have 15, so we're going to move up here. It's going to be 15 people playing the violin out of, well, 20 and 25 is 45, plus 15 is 60. So when you're finding out a percent, one way to think about that is a proportion. And really what's happening is a percent is out of 100. So 15 out of 60 as a percent will equal something out of 100. And one way to look at this is that, well, 15 times 4 gives me 60. So what number times 4 gives me 100? Well, that's the same thing as 100 divided by 4. And that's 25. And that makes sense. 25 times 4 is 100. So x here is 25, and 25 out of 100 is 25%. So in this problem, the answer is B, 25%. And you can almost see it, right? This right here, this, this chunk, it's like one of these quarters right here, but just turned a little bit this way. All right, hope that helped.